Hi, Jeffrey Langlois at Langlois Vital Nutrition Center here in Brookfield, Wisconsin. Our mission is to help you improve your health naturally by helping you to get smarter all the time. The smarter you get, the better you'll be able to take care of your own health. Your health is your responsibility at what you eat, what you think, and how you move. Thinking, moving, and eating. Those three things will make you healthy, okay? You got to think good, clean thoughts. Just get rid of the negative thoughts. Don't let yourself do that. Make sure you're moving and make sure you're eating really well. That's your job, okay? Your doctor is there for emergencies. Okay, um, really important one here, and as I always like to say, is uh, I, right now um, there's three measurements I love to have to help you take care of your health, and that's the mineral test. Ta-da! Minerals, key to your health. Minerals are little batteries. All our batteries are made out of minerals. Why are they made out of minerals? Minerals hold electricity. Okay, there's a mineral wheel. These are all different minerals and how they react, interact in your body. Okay, but minerals hold electricity. We have the incredible heart sound recorder where we get to look at those valves opening and closing in your heart. The most important muscle in the body is the heart. And then, of course, uh, and that, that's the ideal, what it really ideally should look like. And then my other favorite one is your blood sugar. Either order yourself from any lab test now. You can go online or ask your doctor to do your hemoglobin A1C. That is a three-month blood sugar. That's not just your fasting blood sugar in the morning. That's when you're fasting and you haven't eaten and your blood sugar could be fine. But we want to see what your blood sugar is doing all day long. So it could have, be having high spikes. And if it keeps having high spikes based on what you're eating, that leads to dementia. Incredible research talking about how dementia is really a sign of prediabetes. And diabetes, when you're already in your 40s and 50s, leads to dementia later on in your life. I posted the article. She'll give you a link for it. Um, clues that you may be pre-diabetic, okay? So I uh, have a normal fasting blood sugar less than 100. You can see right here does not rule out diabetes. You are probably pre-diabetic if in, in are at increased risk, okay? Having a normal fasting blood sugar lesson does not rule out diabetes, okay? And the link, dementia associated with a high rise in blood sugar after meals. Remember, the, the one that you take at the, that your doctor orders is when you're fasting. This is after your meals, okay? So clues that you may be pre-diabetic, okay? So you get your hemoglobin A1C, definitely it's got to be below 5.6, 5.7. That's per your doctor. I like to see it around 5.1 or 5 or below. You got to keep your blood sugar down. It's going to help. It's going to help your whole life. So, uh, so what are the clues? You can pinch more than two inches of fat under the skin near your belly button. So a two-inch pinch of skin around your belly button. You have a big belly. Your buttocks is small compared to your belly. You have a hemoglobin A1C. That's the one I'm telling you to order from your doctor. It might be 30 bucks. It's really inexpensive. The beauty of that test is it's a three month. It's every literally every minute for three months. Uh, they say here you want to be below 5.7. Ta-da. Um, your blood sugar one after one hour after meal is higher than 145. Well, you wouldn't know that unless you had a glucose meter, which I do. I keep, I check my blood sugar, not all the time. You have triglycerides higher than 150. Your HDL is less than 40. Okay, so those, so the belly pinch fat is a sign that you may have be pre-diabetes. Anyway, the article's posted. I got this again from the Epic Times. They have excellent, excellent medical really well-researched medical articles. I posted that for you. You'll see the link for it. And that's on dementia, okay? You got to keep your brain, your body healthy, okay? All right, I'll see you in the next video.